Hey, what's good, everyone? Adrian F.E. here. You see this smile, yeah? A smile like this usually has to do with indies or RPGs when it comes to your boys. So you, you can probably imagine this is about both. And it is because the people over at Dreams Uncorporated and Sick bring us a Chrono Trigger influence time travel game called Chris Tales. Check it. Strange dreams. I think it's a memory of my mother from long ago. We need to hurry up. We have to stop her. I do feel a connection. There's something there. I am Wilhelm the Wise. You, it seems, are a time mage, as am I. And while my powers have led to my youthful appearance, yours are the gift to see possibility. Who are you supposed to be? Hello, my name is... Tell me if we survive. You know how to fight? Hold your ground. They won't get past us. So many questions. Matthias the Frog, at your service. I've been keeping an eye on you for some time now. I suspected you had been chosen, my dear. It appears I was correct. This will serve as a good opportunity for me to demonstrate my capabilities. I am certain I was created with a purpose. I wish to discover what it was. We'll have time for your banter later. Let's move forward. Hold on. You have a talking frog, and you didn't mention it? A talking frog is like in my top five animals I want to meet! Okay, that, that's a gorgeous game. I mean, scintillating colors, striking and vibrant. You'll even find that a lot of the background is influenced by Colombian architecture, which is inspired by the Colombian studio. So that makes sense. And it features 60 music tracks to pair wonderfully with all this visual input. So on that topic, let's dive into the trailer deeds. Now I do want to keep talking about the visuals because they're utilized well in many ways. Like towards the end, we get a good look at a bunch of the scenes and characters you'll meet along the way. What got me though, is the way the camera in game will zoom out to give you a good view of the scope of the town you're in. Kind of like what happens in Spiritfarer or Bravely Default. Also accompanying the visuals is this like triangle split on the screen, like it's shattered, like if Patrick Beverly played against it or something. That represents past, present, and future simultaneously. These areas are showcasing the same towns in all three timestamps at the same time. Now beyond that, the fun part also is the actions you take in each will affect quests, towns, and endings. Whether it be helping someone or, in the trailer, taking a piece of fruit from the future to bring back and utilize in the present or past. There's even a sequence where you manage a plant that grows to a vine you climb later on. And the same goes in the battle. With those very Persona style menus, you can invoke crystals to send enemies to the past or the future, changing their attributes, weaknesses, and appearances. And you can pick up on these different nuances through multiple battles or using enemy checks, just like you would in any RPG with their version of Analyze or Libra, or whatever you want to call it, right? But don't worry. You'll have time. If you're teen or older and looking for 30 hours or more to spend in the future, your time is now. 